Hi, all signs, and thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel. Please keep in mind my readings are general, may or may not resonate, so take what does and leave the rest. Also, please be sure to check your sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs for more insight, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you guys would like to book a personal with me, ask me a question, or just check out my horoscope page, everything that you need will be down in the comment section listed below. I am doing personals, okay? So if you would like to book a personal with me, again, everything will be down in the comment section below. All right, you guys. So let's see what we have for you guys today. Uh, those are the wrong way. All the way from Aries to Pisces. Let's get some energy. You guys, um, I may not be able to leave timestamps. I am extremely busy. It is Friday, and y'all know Gemini's like the party, and my birthday is next week. Um, feel free to leave your time stamp for your sign. Um, and don't forget to hit the like button so I, we can share this with others. You're not the only person that wants to hear this message, okay? So, Aries, let's see what we have for you. Will you marry me? Wow, Aries, somebody wants to marry you, okay? You have, you deserve love. You are lovable. You have the chariot. Let's move forward. Let's move on. Eight of swords. You're being afraid to move on with this person. Two of cups, but having a strong connection to them. The lovers needing to make a choice. Unlikely, but I feel like you feel like this is not um, what you want or this is not your true happiness. And spirit is saying, if you feel like that, don't fucking force it. All right. Thank you, Aries. So, Taurus, Eight of Pentacles, you are working on something. You are putting your all into something, okay? You are saying, this is what I want to do, so I'm doing it. But Spirit is telling you, you need to release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. The Seven of Swords, there's some sneaky bullshit going on, all right? Um, the Queen of Wands, it could be an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius that's doing the sneaking. Um, the Knight of Swords, I feel like this is you trying to rush into this person or this is you trying to move in or go towards a person, but with the Eight of Swords, this person is not seeing things the way you're seeing them. I feel like this person may be feeling stuck in their head because maybe this is something they, they don't want to do. All right. Listen to your intuition. If it feels off, it probably is off. Okay. The thinking man, I think you already know that this is off. You already know that it's time to release this person, but your ego, of course, you're a fixed sign. You're fixated on something, on working this out with this person. But it's dark in there. You can't see a fucking thing. Get your head out of your ass pronto. You're not seeing things straight. You're seeing things from your ego, which is in your ass, clearly. <laughs> All right, thank you, Taurus. Gemini, we have the justice in reverse. So something was absolutely unfucking fair. All right, it was unfair, and we know that. Okay, reconciliation, but somebody is going to be trying to make a return. All right, yeah, three of swords, somebody who may have broken your heart. Yep, four of cups. Uh, I feel like this was somebody who may have rejected you, this is somebody who may have made you feel unwanted. Um, yeah, the high priestess, this person wasn't speaking to you, they may have ghosted you, or they weren't telling you what was going on. Ask your angels. Make sure it makes sense, okay? I always tell you that. You're an air sign, which means you are a, a infinite thinker. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius is our infinite thinkers. If it's in your chart, that's cool. But when it is your sun sign, it is infinite for you. Which means when you think it, it's usually fucking right, all right? Financial constraints. Watch your money. Don't spend too much money and stop fucking whining. It says no one wants to hear that shit. Complaining makes you weak. You have the strength to change the world, so do that. Sis, bro up. Now, cancer. We have queen of cups in reverse. Ooh, this is you not feeling something anymore. Not wanting to give, not even wanting to act like you want to give to the situation, okay? Finances and career because you're going where the money resides. You're, you're more focused on your finances, eight of swords, but you are in your head about something. Feeling stuck. Two of pentacles. Needing to make an informed decision and quick, okay? Ten of wands. But I feel like it's hard for you to move on or move around when you got all this stress, okay? You're stressing about something or someone, a decision that you need to make. Spirit is saying there's something better, so you don't have to make a choice to choose this person. The door to romance is opening, so something new or better or different is definitely coming coming in you also need to focus on yoga they say ancient shit is cool i believe them 
All right, thank you, Cancer. Leo, we have, I cannot be faithful. All right, so this person, no matter what you do, you can beat this person over the fucking head. They still want to cheat. And as you get to know your person, I feel like you know that. All right, 